Go Dawns! Well, I don't think it's very difficult for uh, any USF team to get up for the Broncos. Obviously, they're our traditional arch rivals. Um, Santa Clara, after a slow start in conference, now put a couple of good you know, uh, s scores together, and they truly believe they're back in the race. So, you know, on Wednesday, they're going to be fighting for their last chance to, uh, to compete for the WCC title. So, I think it's going to be a, a team that is, uh, is going to take us very serious. They, 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 they know we have a pretty good team. And, you know, our team also realizes that not only is Santa Clara our arch rival, but if we want to continue to contend and stay in the race for, for WCC, Wednesday night is a crucial game. Well, I think, uh, you know, the last couple of home games, we had uh, a lot of alumni from various decades coming back. And I think uh, so far what they've been able to see is, is, is a young, energetic team that really wants to compete and is trying to play good soccer. And I think uh, whether it is next Wednesday or the remaining four games of the regular season, that's what we're trying to do. And, you know, we hope that the alumni walk away from uh, the game and go like, this is a, the future is very bright for USF soccer. You know, I said, number one, you know, if you're long enough in the game, soccer is a funny game. You know, in, in all fairness, you know, uh, the first 20 minutes, San Diego had quite a few opportunities that we were able to deflect and sustain. And then we scored a, a timely goal, not only the first goal, but we scored a, a penalty kick of Vega Carlson right before halftime. And I think that gives you a lot of momentum going to halftime. And then we just, you know, we defended well, got a couple more scoring opportunities. And the thing that really is pleasing to me is that, you know, uh, we've worked hard on both the defensive and offensive side in our restarts. And we're starting to score on, on corner kicks and free kicks. And I think that's such an important part of the game that uh, can make the difference between winning and losing. And I think this is one part of the game that this young team is getting that, you know, the de it's all about details.